Hey y'all! We just got back from our trip to Singapore. It was amazing. Yeah, it was awesome. We had so much fun. We never really got a chance to record a intro to a video, so we thought we'd do it now. And um, so I hope you enjoy all the clips from our amazing trip. All right, video audio test. Bloop, 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 bloop. All right, we're about to walk into the cloud forest, gardens by the bay. First impressions. It's crazy. It's unbelievable. Apparently this is the tallest man-made waterfall in the world inside. There's one taller that's on a building, I think, but this is the tallest indoor man-made waterfall. What do you think of it? It's gorgeous. It's amazing. How cold do you think it is in here? Oh, it's freezing in here. I am actually freezing. Go get our feet wet. Okay. Let's go. I'm kind of expecting like a dinosaur to pop out. This looks like Jurassic Park out here. just such an impressive structure like the amount of effort it took to build this thing is unbelievable a little bit of fertilizer fun fact this is my most favorite plants they even got legos over here Legos? yeah so this is the lost world even named after Jurassic Park. Pretty cool. It's the cloud walk. That's a long way down. Yeah, it is. <laughs> the amount of people here that are just standing still with selfie sticks is unbelievable. What? The amount of people here that are just standing still with selfie sticks. Yeah. I'm glad they were banned here. I don't know. Like at least I'm trying to stay moving. I'm trying to be somewhat considerate of a selfie stick user. All right, I don't think we're getting a better view than this. Yeah. So. Agreed. Yeah, there's a lot of people pushing and shoving here. So. Smile for the video. Yeah, it's pretty unbelievable. Which way is Sunset? You know? Uh, I assume behind NBS, kind of over there. Fun fact, sunset in Singapore only lasts 12 minutes. You see the great big huge trees outside, those are going to be lit up in a little bit. Got here at the perfect time, it's about sunset, so we're hopefully going to be able to see a lot of really cool stuff here. Alright, so someone wanted to go into the castle. I'm Disney Princess, face it. So, we're going to go into the castle real quick. So if you're ever wondering what the inside of a castle looks like, this is it. Everything you were dreamed of? Yeah, of course. So here are the great big huge man-made trees up close. <coughs> Alright, so I actually want to see what they look like. It's kind of just the lattice of metal, a whole bunch of plants on it.
I'll do Sean this. You. It's 60 degrees back home right now. That's yeah, very cold. We're in powerful little India. It's pretty cool down there. there. Now he wants to go take pictures of stuff. So we're gonna go take pictures of stuff. It makes, it makes up for like, not going to see actual like, real elephants though. Look at, look at those. They're so cute. So what did you think of the shops of little India? India. Got one of the big temples over there. I think it is under restoration right now. It's a little loud here by the highway, but we're gonna try to make it work. Go again. Oh, don't hit us, 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 don't hit us. Okay, we survived the road. We survived the road, yay. Literally what it's like all the way down Little India. Like a few temples and a bunch of stores selling garbage. Yeah. Alright, so I think this is the Deepavali festival. Uh, it's not nearly as packed as it was a few days ago, so we're going to get some footage. Over the weekend, we could not move in here, so it's a lot easier to now. I wonder how long this is going to be up, because I think someone told me that their actual New Year starts on the 6th of November. A little bit of a traffic jam. We're just trying to find a spot to eat our goodies. All right, we are back at Monsoons by the Bay. So a little bit of um, inclement weather here at Gardens by the Bay, but- uh, Just a little. A little bit, but no crowds. We got our umbrella. Megan wore her rain shoes. <laughs> These are not my rain shoes. I may or may not have forgotten that you know them. I wore mine. I don't know why you didn't remind me. Bad boy go. What's going on, guy? Pretty excited about the snail. There's supposed to be otters around here, so we hadn't seen the otters, so we're settling for the snail. God, he is moving. Hey, I'm going to put you up. Yeah. 
dad's all talking to me now instead of Sam. He just chat, 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 chat. But, no, it doesn't matter. Sounds like fun. I was also, also going to mention how we're here because I want my bangle. So perfect. Fake Jake bangle in a plastic. So I worked two cents. But I want it. That would have been a good thing to say on video. Yeah, it would So up here we got oh. one temple. <laughs> we got some cool temples up here. So we're gonna take a closer look at those. I've been bamboozled. You have been bamboozled. Well, that's pretty. That's the Muslim Heritage Center. Here's one of the temples. So we do not meet the dress code to go explore, but we can see quite a bit from here. So we got our Singapore sling here on Clark Key. Pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. So, cheers. Yeah, I mean, I'm not drinking it. I don't think I can afford to breathe the air here. top of the Ion Orchard Skyview. So you can see way off over there. That's the Singapore Flyer, Marine Bay Sands Hotel, uh, Clark Key, all of that is there. Let's go walk around. Hi. Is this the one where we can see Indonesia? I can't remember. It's either that or the Flyer. I want to see all my people. It's a little indie, it's over that way. Yeah. It's near where we are, isn't it? Uh, yeah, pretty close. <laughs> We're on uh, Bank Cohen. Yeah. Oh, God, that just goes on forever. It's Can incredible. you imagine how people that is? It's a lot of people. <laughs> Oh, there's one guy in the pool, all the way down there. What's up, dude? Oh, that one pool right there? No, there's a bunch of people in that pool. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. There's a bunch of people in that pool. 
up here at the top of the mall and they give you like a tour of the entire Orchard Row area, let you know the history of it. And then you uh, get to see all this. It's incredible. There was just a sign over there that said that in Singapore, their days and nights are the same length all year round. Where they are in the globe. Let's go this way. Yards over there with all the cranes. Is that what it is? Yeah. Do a lot of importing here. Megan's birthday, we got her some black currant cake. Can't see it very well. Happy birthday, Megan. Beautiful nighttime in Singapore. On our balcony. On our balcony. Alright, it's Megan's second birthday, so of course she is taking a photo of her second birthday cake. 
second birthday. Happy birthday to me. All right, so here is our Hawker Center over here. Gonna get some cheap food since we just spent almost $11 on cake. Gonna be good. So we got our food. It didn't take us nearly as long as the last time. Last time we waited almost an hour for this place. So I got to worth go it though. Worth it. Got to go my favorite drink guy. He actually has cold drinks instead of like hot drinks. So um, we eat our hawker food. Uh, I think all this cost us uh, seven SG. So uh, pretty darn good. Cheers. Closer. There's Gardens by the Bay East, Gardens by the Bay, Marina Bay Sands, got a flyer right here, F1, place is gorgeous. Alright, so we just got on the Singapore flyer, we have the whole carriage to ourselves, wonderful AC, so um, gonna be awesome right oh yeah yeah we walked around the entire like f1 uh racetrack in order to get here because um once we got on one side of it we could not get around but uh it was worth it though oh it was a beautiful walk yeah got a great view of the marina bay and all that stuff so see you uh the better view all right so we're getting some of our better views here this is awesome so we got like all downtown Singapore over there. Um, that hexagonal building right over there, that's near Arab Street. So we were there earlier. That's where we started today. You see the great big dome over there. That's also part of Gardens by the Bay. There's the Singapore F1 track. So you can see the harbor, actual Gardens by the Bay with the big artificial trees, Marina Bay Sands Hotel. And uh, we'll see the rest of it on the other side. Oh, I took a video. Oh. All right, we just hit the very top of the Singapore Flyer. So there's Gardens by the Bay. Probably the best view you're going to get of it. Here's the other side of it. There's people who were supposed to be on our car. We don't like them. Huge dome. All of Singapore, as far as the eye can see. We're finally getting to the downtown district, Marina Bay Sands. We're gonna get a better view of that in a second. You can see the Helix Bridge down there. That's pretty cool. But yeah, best photo spot the journey. All right, here's another view of the flyer. We got Marina Bay Sands. We got the art museum. That is the floating Louis Vuitton store right there. All that is like one big mall. So we got a nice view of downtown Singapore, Fullerton Bay Hotel. I think that's where the Singapore sling was invented. You can see the Merlion right over there. I don't know if you can see all that. Then uh, we're just walking along the water. It's awesome here. All right, so. There's a big mall, Singapore Flyer, Marina Bay Sands. So we are currently at the Merlion. What's going on with Merlion? I don't know why everyone's taking sports perspective photos where they're like, the water's going in their mouth. They're, it's like they're eating, you know, lion vomit or something. Yeah, it's kind of gross. It's kind of cool though. Yeah. Is that four? All right, so we are at Haw Par Villa which is basically a Chinese culture theme park. It's supposed to spread awareness of like Chinese myths and legends and all that. So uh, yeah, well, it's gonna be kind of cool. It's got a lot of statues that's decorating the area. I think we're on our way to the 10 Courts of Heck. <laughs> so uh, they don't say heck. Hey Megan, go to heck over there. We're going the heck. 
All right, so heck was a little, uh, it was a little grim to get some video of, so uh, they didn't spare any details in there. So um, all we need to know is that, you know, wasting food is bad. Very bad. And that gets you in heck, apparently. And uh, Straight to heck. Apparently we're gonna both be sawn in two. That's our punishment, so. Uh, all, that's pretty good, all things considering. We're not thrown under the tree of knives. Yeah. Or the hill of knives. They really like knives in heck. They really do. All right, so we're about halfway through impressions. Not exactly what I expected. I was kind of expecting a little more museum and a little less Disney World. But it's worth free, so. It is the only place around here that goes into mythology quite a bit. So, it's interesting. This thing has been at it for probably 20 minutes back and forth, mopping the floor. Meanwhile, Megan is asleep in the lap. Hey everyone, we're in probably the world's coolest airport. However, we are here at probably the worst time ever because everything is closed or it's just a bad time to go because of how soon our flight is. See, here's a little guide. They have a butterfly garden, which we really can't get to right now. I don't know if it's 24 hours or not, but it's too far. And they have a sunflower garden, a orchid garden, you know, a movie theater. It's just not a good time for us to go right now because we only have like an hour, less than an hour now before our flight. See, but we did see the kinetic rain sculpture, which is pretty, but not like super impressive. But yeah, we're just gonna chill out before our flight. Just say, so that was our wonderful Singapore vacation. Uh, if you like this content and you want me to make more content like it, be sure to like, follow, and subscribe. Also, be sure to follow me on social media. Why don't you just use that?